we do live in a wonderful age and I think everyone has something to say. I've been asked what kind of a camera and I've gone through this before but I don't mind doing it again. What kind of a camera should I get if I'm to record my cooking secrets, uh, my life story, whatever, so you can share it with your grandchildren and your children. Well, I'm using this little camera right here and um, it's a CX-260 and to me it is really a very nice little camera to do all kind of things. Okay, so I just made a cooking video, how to fry an egg. Now the video is not that important. What's important is how I made it with a little bit light over the stove, um, daylight lamp bulb over the stove and I made this video. Take a look at it and let me know what you think. Actually I am simply frying an egg and uh, everyone knows how to do that but I'm doing this just to show you what a difference lighting makes. Just like me you would use your favorite cooking oil. When frying an egg I like to use butter or I like to use coconut oil. I put a garlic clove in it to let me know when the oil is hot and to flavor my oil. That's all. Of course, medium to low heat is good enough to fry an egg. Once the garlic is nice and brown, I will remove it and discard it and then just put my egg in the hot oil. Of course, you do know that frying an egg is probably the easiest cooking recipe in the world. You simply add an egg and allow the hot oil and the heat to do what they do best. With me, once the egg is cooked sufficiently, I turn the heat off and then I will flip my egg and allow the hot oil to do what it does best. It's all a matter of personal taste really but I like to sprinkle some sharp cheddar cheese on my egg. Again a matter of personal taste I like to put eat my fried egg on toast. Now you know. Okay so this little exercise was all about two things really using um, daylight bulb and making your cooking videos it makes all the difference in the world and cooking with coconut oil or butter because you can eat coconut oil. Did you notice that the food color was correct and that everything was correct? All I used was a little inexpensive lamp over the stove with a daylight bulb in it. LED daylight bulb in it. So there you have it. So I'm encouraging you to make little videos like this and share your secret recipes and your life experiences with your children and your grandchildren. Take care.